wire. Reload. Oh, it probably fell down. Oh well. Okay, wire. Everywhere. I need to use the wire to to um Okay, let's just go down. What's the worst that can happen, right? <sighs> oh, there we go. Lots and lots of ammo. There was no power to the log lift. Oh, where are they coming from? Oh, oh. I'm going to use just freaking everything I have at my disposal here to kill these guys. Stop them from throwing axes by shining them in their face. Oh, I should have just dodged that. There we go. <sighs> okay. We're going to get attacked now. I know it. Okay. Go back. Try and survive, Alan. Three, two, one. Nope. <clears throat> okay, now. Okay, so fine. Don't worry, I got a, a license to do this. That seems fine. What's that? Is that? Oh, it's a hard hat. Oh, I need a hard hat. Been running around this area for a long time without a hard hat. Okay, festive bridge. There's absolutely. Oh, sane. The part of you that is in control is in the cabin, dreaming and insane. I don't think I like that. You represent the part of Alan Wake that is capable of rational thought and planning, which is why I'm talking to you. If that part can regain control, then you have a chance of making it. But a part of you wants to give in. There's comfort in the oblivion of dreams. You represent the part that isn't ready to quit and die. Wait, are you telling me I'm not real? You're as real as anything else in this place. <laughs> so there are two of me? Yes. And the one you called Mr. Scratch, he's me as well? No. no. Zane, are you playing some kind of game with me? I am not the author of your story. How can you say that when you wrote that page about me and the clicker? It wasn't one of my pages. You directed me to it. You had Weaver guard it. Yes, she was needed. And you needed the clicker. But I am not. What? I don't understand. Ellen. You should keep going. I am. Zane? Zane, come on! This is a very... Well, I cleared things up. Come on, boom! Ha ha ha! That is very satisfying. Yo, dog. Hip hopper. Oh, am I getting too old? Is that how you say it? Hip hopper? I'm a hip hopper. Dang. We had hip hop when I was a kid. I listened to Eminem when he was Slim Shady. Okay, that's probably not hip hop. The bridge rose in the unnatural wind. Pump. It was heralding the enemy's arrival. Wait, what Ooh. Okay. Where's my pump? Action shotgun. There we go. Bit more ammo. That's nice. Crumble. Oh! <laughs> Boom. Oh. <laughs> Goodbye. 
Okay, get the boom. That is so satisfying. I gotta tell you, though. I can't reach that boom over there. Maybe I can just blind him and he will walk into the, um... Into the abyss. Oh, yeah, come on. Goodbye. Idiot. Okay. No. Careful with that. Okay. I'm gonna get that crumble there. I'm gonna get that boom there. That should do nicely. And then... Well, I killed him for sure. I'm gonna crumble that. Oh, okay, I'm just gonna kill you then. No problem. In this last, you know, the, the DLC, my uh, my fighting prowess in, in this game has really increased quite a lot. Same. A moment. I can help you here. Hmm. Sorry, I needed some nerd juice. Whoa. How the hell are you doing that? You're a wizard, Thomas. It's like learning to control your dreams. There's a connection. You were in my dream. Yes. I taught you. You fixed the foolish mistake I made with Barbara. Whoosh, he's gone. Give me some, give me some stuff. Nice. All of it. Again, it's very dark and very windy. But there's a checkpoint, so... I am happy about that. Oh! Get, oh! Okay. There's some dudes up there. gonna take care of you. There we go. And then we can hopefully deal with these guys over here. I don't know if there's any behind me, but now there won't be. Okay, I'm gonna burn you like a motherfucker. And I'm gonna reload. Because uh, otherwise I can't kill you. Ow. Uh, wrong button. I meant to do that, I mean. Where is he? I can't see a thing for this flare. There we go. Easy peasy. Nice. I might as well get all of them. You know, just in case. Oh, that's gonna burst. <laughs> oh god. Oh, 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 I die. It was a good idea that I got all of that. Oh shit! No! I think I'm gonna drop a, a flare up there. Because other than that, uh, otherwise, I don't think I'll be able to to actually survive this. There we go. Come at me, birds. Oh, 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 oh. Come on. Nope. It's doing it again. Okay. I didn't get the flash. Come on. Get it. There we go. Oh, 
Okay, it's cool. It's cool. We got it. We got it. Oh, there's one more. Jesus, man. Okay, checkpoint again. <clears throat> Get some healing. Swing. I don't know why I say swing at times. It's really Blake weird. Blake ran for the light. It was pointless. He would never reach it. His life would be snuffed out just as easily as the very thing he thought would save him. Aww. I guess we could turn it on the again. Light gone. All I could do was keep going. Ooh. Rock. Yep. Come at me, bro. <laughs> oh, two shots. Really? What's that? Huh. I gotta say. Okay, we're at Dr. Hartman's. Okay. <laughs> Since we're being so frank here, Alan, and let me just reiterate how happy I am that you've had this breakthrough, I would like to summarize your condition. You have a television for a head. Please, just let me know if you think I'm being unfair. All right. Well, let's start with the obvious. The car crash. Untreated head trauma. All due respect to Doc Nelson, but he's hardly a neurosurgeon. I think that the injury has affected you more than you realize. Yeah, I, I have had bad headaches. Then there's your <laughs> history of substance abuse, which, combined with your chronic insomnia, has resulted in hallucinations and extremely poor impulse control. That's a dangerous combination, one which your wife has unfortunately had to suffer from far more than you. I know. I know she has. I don't think I'm exaggerating when I say that you are existing in a state of all-encompassing denial. Your vivid fantasy casts you as a heroic victim and allows you to skirt responsibility for your own actions. It allows you to solve your imaginary problems and dismiss the things that truly trouble you. In your self-serving delusions, your personal problems are assets that allow you to save Alice, perhaps even the world. <laughs> Dr. Harmon, I... I think that's spot on. I can't argue with any of that. Well, I'm sure I'm stating the obvious. I don't want to labor the point, but, well, um... No, no. I understand. It's important that I face it. Precisely, Alan. You've put so much effort and imagination into this self-deception, but what good has it really done for you? You refused my offer of help, and here you are. Did being so obdurate really get you to a better place? Obdurate? No. No. And did it really help Alice? Was this really the best thing for your wife? Probably not. Probably not. Also, could you do something about the TV head? Out. You know, I've been talking with her. There's something she wanted you to hear. Oh, hey. That sounds like fun. All I ever wanted was to help you, Alan. I ate all the shit you handed out and tried to understand your pathetic, wealthy white male drama until my life consisted of managing your never-ending crisis. I hate you for your childish temper and the arrogance and self-indulgent pride that undermine all efforts to drag you out of the hole you insisted on digging for yourself. I hate you for leaving me in the dark with that insane monster bitch! All you had to do was act like a loving human being for once in your life and stay with me. If your dramatic exit hadn't been more important than making sure I was all right, she would never have taken me. I don't know where you went, but that's okay. I don't want to know. I don't think I'll ever be all right. The only thing that keeps me from killing myself is the hope that I'll never see you again. How does that... Ouch. I... I just can't argue with that. I think I should stay here before I ruin what life she has left. I think this is a breakthrough, Alan. I'm really very proud of you. Whoa. Okay, X. Oh, that's where I came from. Or maybe. I don't know. So tools outside. No. I'm fairly certain I... Yeah, I came from there. 
So how do we actually get out? Hmm. TV head syndrome. That's a nasty disease to be having. <clears throat> Should we shoot? I don't want to waste bullets. We're going to go outside again, I think. It was nonsense. I knew I had saved her. I'd succeeded in that, and that was all that mattered. What I heard in there wasn't the truth. It was just another toxic mirage. It cut deep, but that made me all the more determined to force myself to snap out of it. I didn't want to be that guy anymore. I had to make myself see the light. There were tools over there. How, how am I supposed to? Up, up this way? Oh, that way. Okay. There we go. Tools. No, it dropped off. Oh. <clears throat> oh, keep going, keep going. Whee. I have plenty of, um, of stuff. Plenty of batteries, I mean. Oh, there's the plane. Oh, jeez, yeah. Jeez, indeed. What was that? That sounded like an Xbox achievement. I'm gonna hide in the plane. Uh, oh, oh, yeah, there you go. Come on in. <laughs> Burn! <sighs> okay. Oh, more. Okay, this is just gonna be one of those where you keep going. Just run, Alan. Through that narrow creek over there. Oh! Oh! God, that's dangerous. That was close. Jesus Christ, man. Okay, light up there. Gonna go for that. Swing. Anything up here? No, well, there's that. Nah. I want to finish this. Well done. Thank you. You have come far, but there's still a little further to go. You must take full control of your own mind. Reject all of the fantasies you have constructed. Yeah, well, I think I can do that. A lot of the stuff I've seen here is personal and ugly as hell. I'll admit it hurts, but it's not fooling me. I know it's fake. Good. You are aware. The part of you bent on self-destruction is not. But you must be careful just because you know the lies for what they are. That doesn't make the danger any less real. I'll make it. I don't have any choice. Here. I cannot come any further, but this will help you on your way. Thanks. So we're close then. Yes. Memory and Ignite. Hey, let me tell you something, Alan. I know how your mind works. You screw up, then you start analyzing it, and before you know it, you start writing all these horror stories in your head. Oh, thank God. No. I know how it goes. You're a complete failure. I hate you and I'll never forgive you for whatever it was that you did. Am I right? <clears throat> oh, man. See? They I kept you. Oh. coming. But there Alan, were too many of them. Oh. Hordes and hordes of them. I'm clear. Swarming over the landscape. I'm going to kill. Okay, I'm going to try it clear now. No, 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 no. This time they began with sheer numbers. Ah, that's nice. Try it again, I guess. <laughs> I like that. I'm gonna go in here. Whoa! Come on, break that wart, damn it! Okay, that didn't. Oh, there we go. Gonna... Oh, I should have waited. Maybe it'll catch them. Maybe it won't. There we go. 
That was very satisfactory. Oh, oh God! Uh, oh. I'm just gonna try and Whoa -ho -ho -ho. kill as many as I can. Dodge it! Oh, how cool was that? Yeah, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got it, I got it. Use a flare. And then clear. Nice. And then that should take care of them, hopefully. Sounded like it took care of them. It's cool, it's cool. Come at me, man. Whoa, there's a lot here. I shouldn't have used that flare. I have only four to go. Okay, I'm gonna try something different now. Use that and then I'm gonna bolt. Hopefully. Hopefully. It'll just catch whatever comes. Okay, well, there's the light. So, phew. Yeah. You wanna come in here? That's fine. What? Chicken? Oh, okay. Oh, more. Oh, shit. Okay, well, I think this is a pretty decent way to go about it. Uh. Okay, maybe it just clears whatever is near. So, oh, God. Okay, I'm just going to try and tap this. As often as I can find it, really. Oh god. Come on, come on. There we go. Where do I where do I go? Can you go up here? Oh Ellen. Okay. Yeah, it's fine. Just Get to the light. There's light up there. There's light up there. We're at the we're at the lighthouse. We made it. The lighthouse. I was relieved to have made it here, but I wasn't sure what was going to happen now. Dun 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 dun. Looks different. No, it's, it doesn't. I just didn't see this. Okay, so I guess we go up. All the way up. <clears throat> Zane had left me. I wasn't sure what the Dark Presence had done to him if he couldn't follow. But from now on, I was on my own. Still, he had gotten me this far. I would never have made it by myself. This thing was going to end. It wouldn't be long now. Good to know. Is that the tornado? Why is the light out? The turn. Okay. Another lighthouse? Oh, oh, we, oh, oh, we're at the diver's idol. Okay. <laughs> it's like, another lighthouse? I was surprised by the change of scenery, but not much. I was starting to understand the symbolism, the way the dark place flowed. Wow. It's gorgeous, Alan. It's something, all right. Bum, 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 bum. Ooh. Wow.
So not quite done yet. Hey, Barry. Hey, Al. Oh, feeling kind of depressed here. What's wrong, buddy? What? So Zane's your new buddy now. I feel abandoned. No, Barry. It's ridiculous. You're not even real. That doesn't mean I don't have any feelings. Stop being a woman, Barry. <clears throat> You're still my bro, Barry. Don't worry. Thing is, you need to get all rational here. Abandon your fantasies, right? Well, I kind of hate to say this, pal, but I'm one. Fine. You're abandoned. Fine. Goodbye, Barry. Sorry. My microphone has been askew for this entire sitting, so I'm sorry about that. Al, what I'm saying is the only way you're getting in that cabin is through me. It's one of those kill your darlings things. But hell, you're used to that, big shot writer. Am I right? It was in everything. It was even taking the people Wake knew, turning his friends against him. They were all against him. What does it say about you? When you're this desperate to keep yourself from getting better. Oh, Here Barry. Barry, don't make me do this. Barry. Barry, man. Buddy. I will do it. Don't make me... It's great that you first make yourself an imaginary friend, and then you can't even get along with that guy. I don't want to kill Barry. Bird like cabin. Barry, don't make me do this. Okay, we're fully stocked. I think this is the final showdown here. Whoa. Let's crack that writer's book of yours, Alice! Hartman, you are really fast. And Bert. An expert on murder and dark alleyways. And a master of substance abuse. That's Hartman. Hartman, could you stand still? Because I don't like what you've done to me. And I would actually like to kill you. Come on, stand still, Hardman. There we go. Could we discuss your relationship with your father? <laughs> I don't have father issues, Hardman. Okay, there's some more stuff here. <clears throat> oh, two now. Oh, it's the brothers. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's funny though. Come on, die. I'm sorry I had, I had to oh, do that to you, but. Because you were cool, man. There you go. Come on. Sorry about this. It's totally not. You have to literally pay your best friend to hang out with you because. Barry, no, no. I don't want to kill you, Barry. Don't make me do this, Barry. Okay, I'm going to take care of the birds first. There you go. Sorry, I need to put out this cigarette. Barry, I, I really... Oh. Don't. I'm sorry. Barry, oh, you're not real. More? Okay. Barry got close. Oh, 
Oh shit, come on. No. Okay, I got the birds. Oh man, he's close. Okay, I gotta drop a flare or something here. Just to keep him at bay. I'm sorry, Barry. This hurts me more than it hurts you. Oh shit! Oh god! No, 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 no! I don't want to die now. Get the birds at least. There you go. And then Barry. Where'd he go? He's over there. Need some more batteries. Some more berries. <laughs> I'm sorry, dude. Ugh. Killed Barry. But he's not real. It's not the real Barry. What's down there? No. Can't even. Nope. Let's finish this. the way he had, and I might not make it back a second time. Leaving this place would be hard. Maybe impossible. It wouldn't take much for my thoughts to stray again. It was too easy to get lost in the dark place. Before, I was ready to curl up and die, let myself slip away. But here I was, the yet unwritten future waiting to unfold before me, a sequel to Departure. My name is Alan Wake, and I'm a writer. Okay, <laughs> I guess that's the end of Alan Wake. It answered some questions, uh, and I guess, I, I guess we, we sort of know what happened to Alan now, and I, I suppose there's going to be <clears throat> a third DLC at some point, there's not at the moment, um, or maybe not, maybe that's just the end, he's, you know, he's going to be down there, struggling to get out, but, um, but yeah. Thanks for watching guys, this is absolutely the end of Let's Play Alan Wake. It's been a long run, like probably 13 hours I think, but it's been a really good game. I really enjoyed it. I've said all of this in in the end of the actual game, after episode 6. I'm not going to daddle too much. Um, thanks for watching, I appreciate it. If you like this Let's Play, tell a friend, tell your mom, tell your sister, if your sister's hot. Tell her, um, you know, sh share the love. You know, this was uh, it was nice. I'm 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 happy to be able to share this exper experience with you guys, and uh, I hope you enjoyed it. Until next time, see ya. <laughs>